Okay, good morning and God bless everybody. In the name of our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ. It's a little chilly out here this morning, so had to bundle up. Okay, um, every now and then, you know, you guys, I get these people that want to keep on saying um, we're all going to naturally sin forever. You know, we'll never stop sinning. And, uh, you know, when we get into scriptures, you guys, it clearly tells us those that fear the Lord depart from evil. And we know sin is evil. That is of the devil. And, uh, and it says you'll know them by their fruit. Okay, we know we all were in sin at one time. And uh, we no longer do the things we once used to do. But uh, when I see these people, they paste their little comments up there, always wanting to condone sin. You know, it makes me think, who in the world would condone sin? And guys, this is who would condone it, okay? People who... Uh, who know that the judgment of God, that those that commit such things are worthy of death. And also it clearly says um, the law was written for sinners and ungodly men. Jesus Christ came to fulfill that. And those who abide in him sinneth not. That's why it says you must be born again. And we stop. We don't do it no more. And it says those who willfully sin, there remains no more sacrifice for sin. These are who we got constantly coming up against us, you guys. Romans 1.32 Who knowing the judgment of God, knowing the judgment of God, that they which commit such things are worthy of death, not only do the same, but they have pleasure in it. You know where he says, I will send them strong delusions because they took pleasure in unrighteousness? This is what we're dealing with, you guys. People like this that want to continually uh, come in and, you know, try to condone sin. We're here on this channel and other channels like this. We're always uh, coming against sinning. And we're reading the scriptures that tells you that uh, he who sins is of the devil. And we know we once all were walking according to the course of this world. And that's where we know by grace we were saved by faith through Jesus Christ. Washed away our sins where he remembers them no more. So if he remembers our sins no more, yet we still continue sinning. Does that, you see where that where that is, where he continues sinning, you know, you're, then you're back under the law, you know, you're, you're putting the yoke back on your neck, you know, Christ came to free us from that, but if you don't abide in him, yeah, you will continue to sin, you know, that's why it says those who are manifesting into obedience and those who are manifesting into sin, they keep, um, submitting themselves to Satan. That is who they serve. That is who they obey. You know, you're, this is what we're doing here. We're here to make a choice who we will serve today. Like Joshua says, as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. You know, sin's a choice, you guys, and many people are making that choice. Anyhow, you guys, I'm going to be going down the hill making a videos possibly two and uh, it's freezing up here right now anyhow God bless everybody in the name of our Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ be strong and abide in the Lord you guys and uh, those that want to keep saying that they're sinning every day remember Jesus said all things are coming abroad nothing will remain hidden anymore so they're going to uh they're going to be telling you that. That's why we see Hollywood openly admitting to being satanic. That's why we see the government passing laws that are an abomination to God. You know? 
man's laws, man's ways. And this is where you guys, we want to be separated from all them right now. And know this, they're going to be hating us the closer we get to this, okay? They're going to be hating us more and more, especially those that are trying to condone sin all the time. You know who they are. And if anybody says that they're sinning daily, what kind of fruit is that? God bless you. In the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ.